Well, it's a bright sunny Monday. It's not overly hot today. It's going to be in the 80s, I think. We're getting ready to start on this project of so that restore job. This is not so hot today. You know, the one I picked up yesterday. Okay. Let's get to work. First, we're going to start out with this. It's like a Scotch Bright pad on an angle grinder. And then we go into our super duper sister wheel 4 Max. It goes on that wheel right there on the buffer. Stand by. Well, I can tell you that that Norton, what's it called? Rapid strip. Look what it does. That's a fantastic. Now that's just that wheel. That's nothing. I haven't done any buffing or anything to it yet. All I got to do is buff it up now with some of that compound. You can see the name of it now is Catarog Goggles or some damn thing. It's amazing. Beautiful. You see that big scar we saw yesterday is still there. I'm going to leave that in there. Got a couple of nicks in the blade right there. This had a little rough life for, for an old baby. I don't think you can see any better out here in this bright sun. Okay. Stand by for sizzle wheel action. There's a lot of these knives on eBay for sale. From $80 to $150, there's one for $350. Some call them World War II combat fighting knives. Some call them United States Marine Corps fighting knives. Some call Quartermaster U.S. Military Combat Fighting Knife. It's got lots of different names. But whatever it is, it's a Cataragus 225Q. You see the numbers right there. 225Q. And it worked out nice too with a little oil on it. I didn't show you that part, but you can live without that. That's the only thing that's stay there is that nasty slice maybe from a grinder there's a little bit of a hint of one right there and one right there but other than that that baby's ready to go I got the edge nice and sharp he said he wanted to take it camping with him so I left it a little toothy so he can cut rope and trees and hack it and whatever he wants to do with it. All in all, a nice little job. Yeah, I think he said it was his grandfather's knife. She's ready to go now. 